In this video, we will be constructing the altitude of a triangle. So an altitude is a segment that starts at a vertex and is perpendicular to the opposite side. So when we look at our triangle here, there are three vertices and you could pick any vertex to use. I'm just going to choose this one over here. I'm gonna start by bolding this point and I'm gonna be now completing the steps for the perpendicular line through a point off the line construction. So I'm gonna put the starting point of my compass there and I'm gonna create an arc that intersects this side twice. If yours is too short, like mine is here, you can simply just use a straight edge to extend that side so that you have your second intersection. Now that you have your two intersection points, you can see mine are bolded there, you're gonna basically complete the perpendicular bisector construction. That's where you put the starting point of your compass on one endpoint, and you're gonna find a measurement that's close to or above or equal to the other end point. Okay, so once you have one, there's many correct ones that you could choose that will work out. You are going to make a nice big arc. And then you're gonna put the starting point, that gold ring of your compass on the other end point using that same measurement. We are going to make an arc in the opposite direction. Those two arcs should intersect twice. They should also be in line with our initial vertex. So finally, we're going to use our straight edge and we are going to line up the two intersections and that vertex. Okay, so you're really lining up three things here. So really adjust your straight edge to make sure it's accurate. When you're happy with it, you're gonna draw a nice straight line through. You can see that the altitude starts at a vertex and is perpendicular to the opposite side. So this piece that I'm kind of bolding over right here, just for the sake of this video, that is basically the altitude of the triangle. 